until somebody gets to the core before they can. The floor starts giving way under the lightest step. A single panic squirt could bring the whole place down. Fragments of the old world rain from the sky. Well, the path ain't exactly open to visitors no more. Security's all fired. See, the path was intended for leisurely strolling and such. Sky bridges link the path together. One of them bridges whips the kid along. Finds a spyglass, like the ones they'd use to search the stars. Air travel always was an iffy proposition. The calamity changed everything even where the wind blows. Well, if we mastered the winds in the old days, we can do it again. But the question is, Who else could have taken the core? Well, ain't no survivor stole the thing. Scumbag ate it by mistake. Tough break. Unlike the kid, that core ain't coming back. No, they used to ship live munitions down the path. Find time to find them. Oh. These wires to toss those things plenty far away. Even gas fellas need some shut eye from time to time. They get real cranky when you wake them up. Toil, kid keeps coming back to an overwhelming question. Who else could have survived the calamity? Hmm. Person with a cat? That's what it's it looked like. It's cold in here. It sucks. So he didn't find the core that time, but that ain't about to stop us.
got it. I don't know what a dupe of ass. Disappeared. What the heck? Where'd he go? Stranger. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, I knew he was there. We could always see the stars. We just never could reach them. No matter how high we build. Kid packs a special surprise in every one of those arrows. Clockwork piece for I'm guessing it'll be something a little bit steam monkey. Um Let's try it. Melting pot to see if we can actually get us a um, thingy. Or, because I really would like to get one instead of just having something like that. My friend, the worst scumbag eats the corn. In better days, the melting pot was sealed tighter than the skin on the squirt. Of all the plans to survive the calamity, it had to be stab weeds. Blasted things hurt like a broken heart. If there's a core, he figures it ought to be deeper down. Or stuck inside one of those fancy cages. Some of the stuff lying around is downright dangerous. He throws a switch. Now what could possibly go wrong? Quite a bit, as it turns out. The cage starts lifting from the core ever so slow. All Kid can do is wait. Shipments start falling in. Not every squirt's born bad. Some spring to the kid's defense. Judging by the movement of the cage, it's gonna take a little while. 